Welcome back to another video. Let me tell y'all something right now. If you read that title, you already know where this video going. But I'm gonna basically be 100% like I always do in all my videos. Y'all know I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna clickbait, I'm always gonna give y'all my true opinion. Season 1 of Call of Duty Mobile look real, real nice. But didn't every other season look nice too? I mean, you know, ever heard that saying when it's too good to be true? Normally ain't no good. Did y'all see that battle pass that they giving us? Did y'all see them scans that they giving us? Did y'all see them guns that they giving us? The battle pass is good. I give the battle pass a 8 out of 10 on a good day. Just because they added that Spectre's Chrome skin and I love that skin. But... That's what we're not here for. We don't care about the cosmetics. We worry about is this slide glitch when we slide and crouch. Is that going to be fixed? We worry about is a desync going to be fixed? Is my frames going to be dropping? That is the questions that need to get answered in season one. We don't care about all these lucky draws, create some bundles. That don't benefit. Why have mythic guns gold guns and all these nice cosmetics when the core of the game is trash that's like having a Lamborghini but you got a Camry engine inside of it what's the purpose it don't go together that's basically how Call of Duty is it looks good on paper but when you play it it's terrible the game is not broke right now it's at its breaking point Season 1 would have to be the savior because so many people is on the verge of leaving or they already left. Season 1 is going to do one of two things. It's either going to make people run off to another game or it's going to bring people in to play this game. The choice is called the duties. You see how good they advertise paid items. We've been dealing with some of these bugs since Season 7. Season 7 was literally the best season. It was no desync, no lag, no bugs. The only thing was that the items that we got was trash. We didn't care about that. We liked the good gameplay and trash cosmetics. I would rather run around with default skin, default gun with good gameplay, than run around with a $1,000 outfit on and a gun that got kill effects in a trash game any day. The China game is literally better than ours gameplay-wise. Yeah, we have more cosmetic items, but who cares? Nobody cares about that. Uh, we probably not even going to have Tactical Sprint in Season 1. We better have that Warzone feature in Season 1. Because if not, that shows that they're not caring. So, the question in mind is, can Season 1 save Call of Duty Mobile? The simple question is... Can it overconquer all the problems that it already has to face within season 13? It'll take a miracle for them to pull this off. We don't care about these two new guns. Because half of the time the two new guns is always good. Because they got to sell it for lucky draws and stuff. We know how this go. We know what guns are going to be meta. We know what guns are not going to be meta. I looked at the patch notes and they not looking pretty. They barely touched any guns. I think three guns got touch max and they nerfed the Annihilator and Shadow Blade again. That's it. So in order for them to pull off this Houdini trick, which is saving the game from dying, Season 1 better be all so promising. It better run so smooth. We better not drop frames. We better not slide and stop and get on one knee. We better not be throwing grenades and, you know, the kill effect don't work. We better not hit corners and still die to somebody who was shooting at us when we hit the corner already. The sample problems. We already know they're going to have the good lucky draws. We know they're going to have the good crates. We know they're going to drop the bundles. Of course, they never mess up on their cosmetics to make their money. Let alone they took zombies out and never did nothing for that. Zombies was only took out because they couldn't make money. I told y'all that in my old video. I wasn't making no profit. So, I made this video because I'm not biased. Can it save Call of Duty Mobile? I would say highly unlikely. Can it at least ease up on us? Yes, it can. But can it give us that feeling that we have for this game? Probably not. They dug their hole so deep to where 
Our rope don't extend to the bottom, and we can't help pull them out. They stranded down there. And that's all I got to say for this video. And I'm out of here, coach. Catch y'all on the next one, if there is a next one. Of course, I'm going to drop another one. I'm out of here.